Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Welcome to Kedah Matriculation College. Congratulations for all of you because now you are matriculation student. In this video, you are with me, Madam Nur Nadira Binti Omar, and you can call me Madam Nat. Since this is the first video for biology subject, so I will share about the first chapter, Molecules of Life. Stay tuned! In this chapter, you're going to learn about five major classes of molecules that make up the bodies of living organisms. And these molecules of life, the chapter will have five subtopics. We start by subtopic 1.1 water, followed by 1.2 carbohydrate, 1.3 lipid, 1.4 protein, and the last subtopic is about DNA and RNA molecules. Learning outcome for subtopic 1.1 is Hopefully, every one of you can state the structure and the properties of water molecule. A little bit introduction about water. As you know, water is the most abundant compound in itself. It scale 60-95% to of the total chemical content of the cell. So no wonder, 70% of human body weight is actually contributed by the water content. And this is the three basic characteristics of water. First, water is colorless. No color. So if you see the liquid with color, it's not called as water. It is a solution. Second, water is odorless, no smell at all. And the third one is water is tasteless. So I repeat three basic characteristics of water. Water is colorless. Water is odorless. Water is tasteless. And the water will have a natural pH which is pH 7.0. Everyone know the chemical formula for water is H2O. So from the formula, we know that water is made up by two hydrogen atoms and one oxygen atom. H2O. Two hydrogen atom, one oxygen atom. So these two hydrogen atoms, they will bind to the oxygen atom. The question is, how the hydrogen atom bind to the oxygen atom? Yeah, by forming a bond called covalent bond. They form this covalent bond because the hydrogen atom share the electron with oxygen atom. So both will be more stable. So basically, in water molecule, the covalent bond is a bond that binds the hydrogen atom and oxygen atom with the same water molecule. And to be more specific, the hydrogen atom and oxygen atom in the same water molecule, they are bound with a bond called polar covalent bond. Since we know that oxygen will bind with two hydrogen, so these two hydrogen, the angle between these two hydrogen, you need to remember the angle is 104.5 degree. I repeat, the angle between two hydrogen atom within same water molecule, the angle is 104.5 degree. As I have mentioned, hydrogen atom and oxygen atom, they will share their electron. So since that, water is called as polar molecule. What is polar molecule? Polar molecule means that the water has unequal distribution of electron. I repeat, 
why water is called as polar molecule because water has unequal distribution of shared electron. So, the consequence is the region near the hydrogen atom has a partial positive charge. Why? The region near the oxygen atom has partial negative charge. Other than water is polar molecule, you should know that water also able to form hydrogen bond. What is hydrogen bond? Hydrogen bond is formed when a hydrogen atom is attracted to another strongly electronegative atom, for example, oxygen and nitrogen. But in this case, the hydrogen bond is actually a bond between hydrogen atom, which is partial positive charge, and oxygen atom, which is partial negative charge from different water molecules. Remember, hydrogen bond in water is formed when hydrogen atom, which is partial positive, is attracted to oxygen atom, which is partial negative, and they are from different water molecules. Obviously, from this diagram, we can see that each of water molecule can form maximum four hydrogen bond with other water molecules. Now, every one of you take a look at this diagram so that we will understand which one is covalent bond and which one is hydrogen bond. The summary for today's lesson. First, water is made up by two hydrogen atoms and one oxygen atom. The angle between two hydrogen atoms is 104.5 degree. Oxygen is partial negative charge while hydrogen atom is partial positive charge. The bond between oxygen atom and hydrogen atom in the same water molecule is polar covalent bond. Why? The bond between hydrogen atom and oxygen from different water molecules, the bond is hydrogen bond. See you on the next video. Bye!